I have my own dogma, but I think we all have our own dogma. Whether we want to admit it or not. Whether we're nice people or not. I mean, with my dogma, I'm not saying that people are wrong for anything. And I'm not, like, judging them as bad people or anything. I'm not saying there's something wrong with them or anything. I'm just saying that I think some things are stupid. I think doing certain things and certain behaviors are stupid. I mean, I accept them because they're a part of what society expects out of people, but it doesn't make it any less stupid. It doesn't mean that I think everyone who does those things are stupid, although some of them are, just like a certain percentage of our population is stupid. But it doesn't make what they've done any less stupid. The biggest things are the things that take us away from who we are and what we are. Our culture teaches us to be drones to be satisfied with mediocrity, except in the products that we're supposed to revolve our lives around. You know, we're supposed to let products run our lives. Just things that take us away from our animality are stupid. I think shaving off one's facial hair or keeping it like just a little stubble beard is stupid. I think shaving off your body hair is really stupid. Hiding your scent, making sure nobody knows who you are scent-wise, is stupid. Cologne, body spray, perfumes, heavily scented detergent and fabric softeners, scented, really heavy scented hair products. They're stupid. Your natural scent reflects the things that you do, the things that you eat, your general lifestyle, but you're not supposed to let anyone know that kind of thing. It's kind of like when people come up to you and ask you, you know, oh, how's it going? They don't want to know how, it, how you're doing. They don't want to know anything about how you're doing. That's the last thing they actually want to know. They just want this smile and they want you to just, they, they just want a fake happy acknowledgement. It's sort of like even if they don't even say anything, you know, you, you, you walk up, you pass by someone and you're supposed to smile and kind of nod your head, you know. Got to put on that smile, otherwise you're being a sad sack. I mean, your emotions don't matter. You're supposed to be happy or act like you're happy because other people are around. Who you are doesn't matter. Just get where you're going. Do your job. You're there to get something done or you're there for your skills, not who you are. So just forget about who you are. Just forget about it. And that is stupid. Makeup is stupid. The ideas in the Bible about what it is to be a human is stupid. Revolving your life around a product is stupid. You are not a product. You are a human animal with intelligence and empathy. Atheists out there trying to say that they don't judge people for just about anything and that they have no dogma of their own, give me a fucking break. No matter how hard I try, and no matter whether I treat everyone decently or not, I make judgments upon people upon a lot of the things that I mentioned here in this video. Just as I expect everyone else to make judgments about me because of the way I look or the way I smell, or the way I carry myself or something. I expect everyone else to do the same thing, because it's just what we do as humans. These judgments I have, all rolled together, are my dogma. I have a worldview. It's not an atheistic worldview, it's a Kazoom worldview. I do not represent a movement nor an organized ideology. I represent myself.